Hey guys, Mr. Loop Gaming here, and today I'm going to begin a new career mode with a League 2 team, trying to get them to the Premier League as soon as possible. And I thought I'd, the best team to do this with would be clear off our goal, as they used to be in the Championship, but they've fallen rapidly down to League 2, so we're going to try and get them back up to where they belong in the Championship or try and even get them to the Premier League. So we'll begin this career mode playing on world class, four minute halves. We'll keep all these settings the same. So we'll name our manager. So we'll obviously call him Mr. Luke Gaming. Once we've done this, we can begin our career mode. Plenty of our girl excited about the future of gaming. So, here we go. So, in our new career mode with Plenty of our girl. And hopefully, we'll try and get them as far up the league systems as we can. So we'll just wait for this to load and then we can get started and have a take a look at our s starting squad. Well, it looks like we've got five emails already, but we're just telling us what we've got to do. Which run of 32 in the FA Cup? I can do that. Transfer market versus in the form. Yeah, that was uh, Try and find an attacking midfielder. Okay. Maybe we'll have a little look at things like this. Introducing like, scouts. League objectives, right? However, we look forward to seeing any leadership. Yeah, so I just want me to, I want me to win the league title. So I, I reckon I can do that. It looks like this is our starting team. I've heard they've got the star. Here we go. Here's their star striker, Ruben Reed. We're on top form at the moment for Plymouth, is their top goal scorer. So we'll definitely be trying to maximise his potential. As I believe he's 25, so he's probably got a bit of room to grow. No, no, I don't know much about this team. Oh, four star skills, four star weak, but put him in the team. Looks like we've got an awkward formation here. So we just sort this team out. We'll probably go straight into our first friendly with Plymouth Argo. Right, let's see if we can find him again. Where's he gone? Probably looking right at him, or we'll probably put him on the pitch. Here he is. It looks like we've got a weird sort of set up. See if we've got any right mids. Doesn't look like it. it looks like we're sticking with Talbot at right mid. Well, that's the team we're going to the first friendly with. I'll be right back when we hey get guys, to welcome the back. And we have reached our first friendly against whoever this is. Belen and Cess. So I've never heard of them before. But it looks like we've got three friendlies before we begin our campaign against Cheltenham away. So let's go into our first friendly of the season. Playing 
playing a world class for now, but if it gets too easy, I can bump it up to legendary. So off we go. See you at the kickoff. Here we go then. Kicking off our first game of the season is Plymouth Argyle. So if we go with this team, I've forgotten their name again now. Yeah, keep in good position. Oh, this is not some, this is some early pressure here. Good tackle for Miller. Here's the chance to get in the cross. You can keep the attack going on the right side. Just hold them out, hold them out. Make sure they don't get in. Good save, keeper. Alright, it's offside. Here we go. Wooden mid. It's not a good start. <coughs> yeah, the opposition are coming forward now. With forever down the wind. So I hold him off. Forcing him backwards, that's good. Defending. This isn't no. I'm gonna take that. Shocking shot. Now can we start a counter attack here? Play into Ruben Reed. Reed to Alessandro. Alessandro plays it out wide to Banton. Sees the run of Reed. Comes to nothing. I've got Pele. Or Pella. As some people might call him. It's a good ball. Oh, it's just wide. It's a good as for that. It's a good tackle from Banton. Now can we start with the attack? It's a good pass. Alessandro. Trying to link up with Reed. Finds Talbot. Switches the play to O'Connor. Good touch. Tries to find Reed, but it's cut out. Chasing them down, trying to win the ball back. Force them to clear it. Strike to Hartley. Hates it back to McHugh. Into Banton. Banton's got some space to run into here. Runs into it. Feeds him Reed. Reed's in. Has a shot. Saved. Lays it off to Hartley. Gets it back. Plays it into Alessandra. Alessandro into Ruben Reed. Gets tackled on the edge of the box. Uh, that's half time. We're quite a quiet half. But we're right in this game. So, and we, can, we can go for it in the second half. Taking all his man. Gets past one. Ruben Reed into Alessandro. Tries to play for Reed. Reed's Reed through. Good interception for the defender. Ball finds Alessandro. Plays a little one two. Could be in here. Hits it first time. Super safe from the goalkeeper. To the other read. Good little ball over to O'Connor. O'Connor back to Alessandro. And I uh, tried to do a fake shot. But I've ended up shooting straight at the goalkeeper. The chance is gone. Sense it could be one last chance in this match, but maybe, maybe there's one last chance. The referee doesn't let us. And that's the end of the game. And it was a positive performance, but there was no goals. And that is the end of the game. Banton was our player of the match, and there's man of the match was Kavadas of Belenenses. So that's going to be the end of this first episode of the Plymouth Argyle career mode. And when we get back, we'll play our final, final friendly, and then we'll move on to uh, we'll play. Oh, we've got another one. So we'll play our final two friendlies next episode, and then in our third episode we can begin league campaign with an away game at Shelton. Thank you for watching the first episode of my Plymouth Argyle career mode. 
I've missed Luke Gaming. See ya later.